An Ohio lawmaker wants to make sure parents have the most accurate information. Walter Smith Randolph shows us why that could lead to fewer children getting vaccinated. Ohio school children are required to be immunized against several illnesses. That is, unless there's a medical reason, a religious exception, or if parents have a conscientious objection. State Representative Don Manning now wants to require schools to inform parents of those objections. I don't believe that schools are intentionally misleading parents or, or intentionally giving them bad information. It's my belief that a lot of the school employees just don't know what the law is. Manning's bill comes as pediatricians are seeing more and more parents opting out of vaccinating their children, which pediatricians say can be dangerous. They're at risk for a variety of different conditions, and it just it depends on what type of um, vaccinations um, the child may not have. Um, but certainly, you know, anything ranging from meningitis to liver disorders and things such as that. While Dr. Warwick and TriHealth would not comment on the legislation, the Ohio chapter of the American Academy of Pediatrics has spoken out against the bill, saying it could lead to lower immunization rates and costly outbreaks in Ohio. A lot of times parents read something that's out on the internet that may not be valid information or may be inaccurate. And so we want to provide them with the most accurate information so they can make the best decision for their child. Which is exactly what Representative Manning says he's trying to do. This is America. You know, we've got, we have the ability to make choices. And like I said, I will always stand by liberty and allowing people to make choices based on the actual and factual information. In Anderson Township, Walter Smith Randolph, Local 12 News. Manning says he's not an anti-vaxxer. All of his children have been vaccinated.